The stockings were hung by the chimney with care in hopes that St. Nicholas soon would be there. The children were nestled all snug in their beds while visions of sugar plums danced in their heads. And Mama and her kerchief and I and my cat had just settled down for a long winter's nap.
was in such a hurry, I denied the introduction of that song. So if you'll bear with us, we'll do it after the fact. So who had that introduction? Come on down. And it was a nice mixed combination, seventh grade, boy, eighth grade girl from both sets. And then we'll do our really, really quick on the part. And while they're coming down, thank you again. I would love it if your students and or you could help us get equipment back upstairs, up into the band room. The chairs the custodians have requested if they just go up in the multipurpose room, lean against the wall, and they'll take them from there. Thank you for coming this evening. This evening, Mrs. Sharp, we will miss you. But happy friends. Fond farewell. Back in the saddle again. And Oma, you know, it can't take you to North and Army Girl. Home in the ring, so thank you. Thank you for your children. We'll let them do their introduction. We'll do a Kodak moment, and then we'll do a real quick on Hello, my name is Sam, and I play the alto saxophone. My name is Penny, and I play the clarinet. Our final selection features the combined efforts of Burnett Band, Concert Band, and Jazz Band Boys. And Clement Clark Morris' Christmas poem, The Night Before Christmas, was written in 1822 and is still a traditional reading in many American homes. Our, our version, with music arranged by James Swearingen, features traditional holiday carols performed between sections of the poem. To all of these very young Principal Pat Sharp, we'll do the narrative reading of the famous poem for the last time. We thank you for coming to our concert this evening and hope you have enjoyed the performances. Happy holidays from Tuolity Bands. <laughs> 